Mad Cow Disease and the Prion Active prion element causes mad cow disease. Spongiform encephalopathy or cannibal's disease. Cannibal's disease. Mislabeling or cross-contamination between the feed. It comes down to money. But like tracing herds of infected animals, how it came to money has to be traced. Right now, if you're looking to making millions, all you have to do is produce a herd from scratch and treating the cattle in a humane way with utmost proof that your beef is not fed from feed that includes animal products. You must maintain proper spacing between animals. Feed them on a strictly herbivorous diet. Wean the calves naturally as they transfer from their mother's milk to grazing. Stay ahead on turf management and most importantly make sure your herds are not stressed. You need to produce your own beef in your transparent abattoir. The animal must be dispatched in a, human, a humane way. The remains must be disposed of in a complete matter, manner. Uh, the ideal is yet to be seen. But one theory is to render the remains into a topsoil uh, that is used only to cover rocky terrain to become a location for forestry products or orchards. Sure, the other guys are doing it. Get away uh, with feeding the beeves with the wrong thing. They may get ahead for a while but you'd have certification, which could be used in uh, top prestige restaurants and markets. And your stock would look much better in auction. And when the inevitable happens and the mad prion strikes again anywhere in the country, you'll be way, way ahead because you did it right. So let's recap. Mad cow disease and the prion. Active prion element causes mad cow disease. Spongiform encephalopathy or cannibal's disease. Mislabeling or cross-contamination between the feed. It comes down to money. But like tracing herds of infected animals, how it came to money has to be traced. Right now, if you're looking to make millions, all you have to do is produce a herd from scratch and treating the cattle in a humane way with utmost proof that your beef is not fed from feed that includes animal products. You must maintain proper spacing between animals, feed them on a strictly herbivorous diet, wean the calves naturally as they transfer from their mother's milk to grazing, stay ahead on turf management, and most importantly, make sure your herds are not stressed. You need to produce your own beef in your trans, quote unquote transparent abattoir. Uh, the animal must be dispatched in a humane way. The remains must be disposed of in a complete manner. The ideal is yet to be seen, but one theory is to re render the remains into a topsoil that is used only to cover rocky terrain to become a location for forestry products or orchards. Sure, the other guys uh, are going to do it, getting away with feeding the beeves with the wrong things. Uh, they may get ahead for a while, but you'd have certification which could be used in top prestige restaurants and markets, and your stock would look much better in auction. 
And when the inevitable happens and the mad prion strikes again anywhere in the country, you'll be way ahead because you did it right.